It was Vallely who carried the Bruins in the second half to lead all scorers with 29 points. Well, it was the first Final Four for John Vallely. It was Lou Alcindor's third time to be in the Final Four. So we're in against Drake in the semifinal game, and we have no idea what the defense will be, of course, until you get out on the court. But they decided to triple team Lou Alcindor, who became Kareem Abdul Jabbar. And when they tripled him or doubled him, that left others open. And so being a shooting guard, it opened up some opportunities for me. And, and uh, Coach Wooden kind of cleared the left side of the floor and let me go one on one. And if I got doubled up or tripled up, and then uh, they'd stop me and that would leave something open for Kareem. So it was a big scoring night for me. It was really special for us to win the 100th National Championship. We'd never have gotten that if it weren't for all the other teams that had come before you know, I'm trying us. To, trying to find a way to you know, pump the crowd up, pump my teammates up. We just wanted to play our game and we won basketball and fortunately we did. And We had the number two uh, ranked team in the country coming into the Rose Bowl and, uh, and we were ready for it. It was just immediate excitement because I knew that I got all of it to win a Pac-12 title, to get to the Sweet 16, do that all in year one, that's the foundation. That is probably my most memorable moment. The 1960 cha 69 championship team was a new team. I think we focused on things other than winning, which was John Wooden's style, to focus on competitive greatness, being the best we could be. I started to use it in those days because I was a JC transfer, maybe not as talented as some, but talented enough to be picked to play in the backcourt. And so I think we just focused on being the best we could be. We were a good team. So everybody participated in a big way. And on different nights, different players contributed uh, major contributions. You know, when you're open and you're feeling it, you throw them up there and they go in and you go, to, you just become grateful. It turns out that even though I scored a lot of points that night, I fouled out, I think, with about five minutes to go. So again, this, this shows you how important teammates are in anything that we do. Under Coach Wooden's uh, system, the idea was to play your best every time that you were needed. And some nights you might not shoot as well, but you're making the effort to play the best you can. And if that's the result on a given night, you're just pleased that it happened. Could have happened to somebody else on our team and it would have been just as fine. But when you get a chance to get through that semifinal game and then play on the big stage in the final game, of the NC2A. It's a great opportunity and it's a memory I'll always cherish. And even today, I run into people all over the Los Angeles area and all the way down in Orange County where I live and people are still remembering those days under John Wooden and playing with Lou Alcindor at UCLA. That's my most memorable moment.